die. What is that? Whoa! Tire. All right. What is going on, guys? Christopher and Nick here. Today is the day that we're actually going to be bringing the M2 to the, to the drag strip. Now, I'm trying to go drag racing once a week as long as I'm not too busy. But to be honest, I probably shouldn't be going right now because last night I fell asleep at 6. Um, we didn't leave the shop until 1. We had a ton of things that we were doing with drift prep and Jordan's car and all that stuff. And then I had to do two sponsors. Then I had to edit yesterday's video. And then I had to do this and that. And I'm exhausted. And it's currently 7 o'clock. We're going to be driving until 11. And then I need to go back to the shop. I need to load the truck, the trailer. Still need to do an oil change. Yada, yada, yada. And then we're going to OSW. And I think we're going to Adam LZ's new compound. I got another fully packed weekend. So definitely be stoked for that. But we're running the M2, the drag ship, like I just said. I don't know what it's going to run. Um, I just would like to bring a different car every single week and to be honest since I'm a little tired It's kind of nice to be able to just chill in the M2 and I'm actually really curious on um, What this car is actually gonna run of course you could probably look it up online And I'm sure there's a hundred different threads of oh, this is this is what this runs at this power Whatever I want to do it myself. It's more fun Obviously, I'm not as skilled as others, so maybe I'll run a little slower and I can try to get to that time. So we're going to try a couple different runs. We're going to be doing just an auto one with launch control, um, paddle shifting with launch control, obviously all in M mode with everything turned off and all of that stuff. And then if we have enough time, I would love to do no launch control on auto and no launch control on paddle as long as everything goes smoothly. I don't have the best of luck when it comes to the BMW launch control, but who knows, maybe today is a good night, so let's get it. It's still, do you, roll that window down. Uh, it's still warming up? Yeah. Dude, you can make it over there. Um, you can make it, go, <laughs> go, go, start filming. That's a jet car? Dude, we were sitting in the car with the windows up. Pumping my heart. Dude, there was flames coming 30 feet out the thing. You missed it. Just barely. Dang. You should have went up when we saw the flames the first time. Oh my, that was insane. Well, I have the clips from the Cletus and Cars. Oh my God. That was a crazy feeling inside the car. Yeah, looking 100 feet away. All right, after 40 minutes of sitting here, we're finally moving up, fellas. We're about to run our first run ever in the M2. So M1, I have all of the things turned off. Everything is in Sport Plus, but that one's in Auto. In M2, we have everything turned off, everything to the maximum setting, and um, that's with the paddle shifter. So. I don't have to do a burnout, but I'm going to try to just do a little burnout just for the video's sake. Hopefully it does a burnout. I've never done a burnout. I'm just going to hit the brake and mat the gas. I don't really know. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I'm a little nervous. I'm going to up on this burnout. I ain't going to lie. Oh, my launch control activated. <laughs> That's embarrassing. God damn it. Can never win, man. Watch. Ready? The launch control activated. Now it's not going to work. Let's see. Doesn't work now. What a fucking joke. All right. We're, we're in M2 mode. We're going paddle shifts because it's working. messed up because when you're in the launch control you're supposed to let it shift from first to second 
and I tried to do the paddle, so it shifted from first to second, and then it thought I wanted to shift to third. So we completely missed second gear completely. So we're actually just gonna try that again. Honestly, fuck auto right now, because it, I, I don't wanna risk the launch control not working, because that felt good. And that was a huge mess up, huge mess up. Two, two, two. Uh, oh, I can't see the other person's time. Oh, okay. Check That's weird. <laughs> he didn't let me see the other dude's time. He literally, he cut my flip in half. What does that mean? Well, we got a 12 too, and that was a big mess up. I wanted to come here with high 11, so that's sick. Next run, for sure. What was my 60 foot? 1.8. Dang. Dang, brother. So John's actually out there filming right now. I'm just not out there because I am absolutely wrecked. I got five hours of sleep last night, but he just filmed two new Supras and they kind of ran the same exact times and we're only 0.1 second off of that, so. I guess all of the new cars are kind of built at the same exact speed, but we're going to try to get into the 11s. I'm going to try auto this time to see if it's a little faster, but enjoy these little Supra runs. The two Supras doing the exact same times. All right, so my new friend Miguel, the one that actually invited me to this private day, he just sent me the layout, of the OSW course, and I'm not gonna lie, I have a little bit of PTSD going on right now with um, how this wall is looking. So uh, I'll put up the picture right now. Let me know what you guys think. I'm really excited for tomorrow. I'm also really nervous just because I know I'm not gonna get any sleep tonight and I didn't get any sleep last night. I think right after the drift event, I'm just gonna get a hotel go right to sleep and um, just go to Adam's early Sunday afternoon and do whatever the hell we're gonna do there. I don't even know. But uh, I can't even think straight right now. I'm so tired. I'm all dodged out, you know? All right, guys, no burnout. We don't wanna mess with the launch control because I'm dedicating this 11 second pass, 11, nine, 11, eight, whatever it's gonna be, um, to Dogecoin, all right? If we do this, we're going to the moon, fellas. We are going to the moon. As long as the launch control works, we should be A-OK. -okay. I'm going to let the car shift from first to second, and then I'll take over with the paddles because we missed, completely missed second last time. Here we go. I want to make sure we get to the line and, and launch control works and everything. Ooh, this is fresh prep and everything. Here we go. All right, we're good. Bug it. I'm just gonna hold it here. Warranty. Here we go, come on, guy. Ooh, he's legit. He's inching forward, he's ready. Here we go. Oh. Fuck it, man. Woo! That had to be an 11 second. For Doge! Dang it! We didn't go to the moon! 12 1, dude. I let the Doge down. I don't like that, actually. Dang, you beat me by 0.1 second. We got a 12 2, boys. We let it down. Did I do better my first run? Where the hell is that slip? 12 2 4. No, we got a 12 2 2. The first one we got a 12 2 4. Almost the same exact mile per hour. I got a 112.76 in the first one and a 112.98 on the second. 
dang. Those were back to back consistent, but like it's a stock car that kind of does everything for you. You don't really have to do much, but I will say I have to sit here for an hour every single time just to run, like not even exaggerating. And it's very comfortable just to be able to sit in here with AC and chill. So to have a 12-1 daily, not too bad. I ain't gonna complain. We're gonna try another one. I wanna try auto, like really bad and see if that changes any. So uh, it's 9.30. I'll see you guys in an hour, I guess. All right, boys, so we're in M1, which is auto with everything in Sport Plus, all of that stuff. I just wanna try auto. This is gonna be our last run because <laughs> our last run was at 9.30, it is now 10.24, so it literally takes one hour every time. I kind of want to hit up Kyle and see when they're doing like a private day or something, and um, maybe I can hop in that, because then we can get plenty of, we can get way more time, we can actually learn, we can actually do this properly, because it's really hard to learn. I mean, I'm not talking about this car, because you're not really learning much, it's just kind of here for fun, but like you really can't learn if you're sitting in line for an hour and like you know what you did wrong but it's just not fresh in your mind anymore i'd rather do a run come right back up try to fix that problem and try to get a better time rather than just doing three runs a night and being here for five hours but here we go if it doesn't work right here i'm switching to m m2 mode so sticky come on find it okay here we go okay it doesn't work I guess I'm running the same guy again, which kind of sucks, but we'll see. I love that I can just hold the two-step. Like, come on, dude. Why did it go to four, dude? We fucking lost because of that. I wish it wouldn't shift for me. I don't understand that. It does, does the launch control go from first, second to third? And I just don't touch anything? Cause I went to go, I let, I launched it. I let the car shift the second for me. And then I went to go shift to third. I think maybe it shifts to third too. I'm actually not sure, but that fucked me. I literally watched a skip third gear. We would have beat them for sure. Definitely would have beat them. This is what I'm saying though, like if there was a private day, not saying that I would bring this to a private day, like that stupid thing, we're like, okay, let's just line it up and let's try again, you know? Back to back to back to back, instead of making a video with three runs, we're making a video with a hundred runs. But it is what it is. We're, I'm working with what we got to play with, you know what I mean? Yeah, 12-3. Yeah, that's annoying. Completely botched it, because we missed third gear completely. It's whatever. I'm gonna try to do a launch on the street and see if it shifts to third for me. To be honest, I'm not even gonna shift at all and see what happens. All right guys, so we're gonna try to stop in the middle of the road here. We're gonna try to get a launch. I'm not gonna shift at all and I'm gonna see if it works. All right, here we go, come on, let's stop, let's stop. Here we go, right here, right, boom. No shifting. controlling it just takes over yeah I, I think that's what i've grasped of this because now if i floor it it literally will hit rev limiter so i think when you're using launch control i think you just let the computer take the wheel yeah it's probably gonna i think that's what became shifts. illusion of yeah so. computer knows better i mean those those two supras earlier in the video yeah they ran the exact same time down to like the third well, second. I mean, it literally makes sense because, like, if if that 
that's the same thing if you're using launch control and it kind of you, all you have to do is make sure you don't crack yeah and literally was, there's no there's no skill involved whatsoever so like dr drag racing this car drag racing and uh, supra it's it's almost kind of pointless yeah because like it's just gonna do it for there's, you there's no skill just i mean doing it for you. the consistency to me was just amazing 12 17 12 17 same time like it's cool that that's just it's perfect every time though like yeah. you well, can't be faster the, than that's that. the new car life dude so maybe we can't get 11 9. maybe we can maybe that's it maybe the computer's like nah dude this is this is a 12 1 car baby so what it sounds like is you need a supra i don't want a supra <laughs> dude honestly i don't want to like mod this car all i want is tints i just like driving it around like i i I like I think it's cool that I can get a, I can go to the firm and stuff and I can just drive it there, can race, drive home, but like I don't really drive this thing too recklessly most of the time. <laughs> about ninety five percent of the time I drive this normal and about five percent I drive like a complete and utter asshole. And that five percent is what makes it a BMW. The five percent is what makes it a BMW. I will say I don't really use my blinkers too much. Well they're but, awful on these new cars. Why? They're fine. They work great. I don't know. Yeah, it's got the nice click noise. Everything's nice about it. I don't know the ones I've had to deal with in the past. Like you have to press down on it, and you have to press down again to cancel. I think that's the worst design ever. I don't know. Hater. Yep. Go drink some hater, hater. Right I will. I'm gonna go look at my Doge. All right, guys. Well, I forgot to make an outro because it was so late and I was so exhausted. But today is the day. I'm going to OSW. I'm super excited. I'm literally editing this video right before I'm about to leave. So definitely stay tuned for tomorrow's video. I'm going to try my hardest and let's just kill it out there. We're bringing both Miatas and it's going to be a blast. See ya!